It's a beautiful day in this neighborhood. A beautiful day for a neighbor. Would you be mine? Could you be mine? Won't you please? Won't you please? Won't you please be my neighbor in heaven? Shalom. You can tell it's a beautiful day in this neighborhood. I love you, Lord Jesus. This is God's holy channel. This is God's holy channel. Shout out to all the, the subscribers around the world, around the globe. I give God all the praise and glory on this channel. And by the way, I'm going to upload a video by Pastor John Abent. Pastor John Abent. It's a very good video. Guys, we need to be looking for our Lord and Savior now. We need to be looking and watching and waiting patiently. Our Lord and Savior Jesus Christ is coming quickly in the clouds with power and great glory. With power and great glory. Um, I do have something real quick I want to mention to you guys. There is someone going around on YouTube that's using my picture and I don't know if it's a fake channel or what. They're making comments on other YouTube channels. If you get a comment, uh, please contact me. And I will, um, I will respond to you because it's most likely not me, especially if it's an unholy, unfruitful comment. You will know them by their fruits. And if they're using my avatar and channel name, it's, it's not me. I'm going to be praying for them, especially this late in the game, because there is not much time left. Our Lord and Savior Jesus Christ of Nazareth is coming quickly. Shalom. I'm going to make a short video, about a six-minute video, and I want to clearly show the crown that is above uh, Virgo's head. I'm getting a lot of emails, a lot of people questioning this, but here's where the crown is going to be located. You'll see it. I've drawn it there. There's a total of 12 stars um, that are directly above the head of Virgo. Okay, in this video right here, you'll see the circle of stars. I'm pointing to them right there to go around. There's exactly 12 stars. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, and twelve. So there they are. There's a 12 stars of Virgo. So I said they're always there. Uh, the particular uh, screen that you're looking at. This is October 3rd, 2016 with the moon underneath the feet of Virgo. The woman's clothed with the sun. The dragon is standing before the woman. Now, we'll look at this again. And again, clearly, you'll see the circle of 12 stars right above the head of Virgo. The little green dot there is, is Mercury which was above the head and in the crown. Okay, I'm going to be counting this star here and the 12 star and the other 11 stars. Now, what's the magnitude of these stars? And one of the questions is, are these stars easily seen? Well, any star uh, that is of magnitude 5 or greater can easily be seen with the naked eye. The stars that we're going to be looking at are going to be between 3.5 and 4.9, and 4 right? So they're in between. And if you look at this chart, you see that the faintest star that can be seen as a magnitude 4 uh, in the suburbs, right? But outside the suburbs, uh, 40 miles outside, you can see a magnitude 5 star. Here, uh, 100 miles from any suburbs with no light, light pollution, a magnitude 6 star could be seen. 
and even a magnitude 7 star can be seen if you're some 30, 30 miles from major cities or 140 miles uh, out from the suburbs. It isn't until you get to a magnitude 9 that you would have to have binocular to see them even in a dark sky. So the ancients definitely had dark skies and they were definitely able to see every one of these stars as you'll see here in a minute. So we're, we're going to be dealing with stars at roughly 3.5 up to about 4.99 or 4.9 new stars. So every one of them could be seen in a dark sky area by the ancients uh, above the head of Virgo. There's definitely no question about it. Okay, coming up next, I'm going to show you from my CyberSky program the actual names of these stars and their magnitudes. You'll be able to see this. Okay, I set the magnitude for 4.99, so anything dimmer than a magnitude 4.99, 5 and above, will not be seen. Okay, I've turned those stars off. Okay, we're going to look at the magnitude of the stars. The first one. is 4.65 3.58 is the second one third one is 4.3 the fourth star is 4.758 magnitude the fifth star is 4.56 magnitude the next one is 4.725, and 4.84, and 4.984, and 4.614, 3.970, and the 11th is 4.836, and finally the last star is 4.043. There's your 12 stars, all of them of, of apparent magnitude, which are clearly visible in the ancient skies. And in dark skies of today as well, if you can get away from the city. On the 12 stars, it's around, it's over Virgo's head. The dragon before the woman standing before the woman. The moon is under her feet. She's clothed with the sun. And the date of this was October 3rd, 2016 that took place. October 3rd, 2016, as you can see here. Well, I hope this helps clear some things up and people can understand what's really going on in the heavens. God bless.